So you see color changes, sweating changes, trophic changes to hair and nail growth. And of course, um, there's this diabolical pain that can be associated also with highly variable temperature changes where the limb can be freezing cold one minute or very hot the next or consistently one in that the temperature is you know significantly different from the other limb. What's also interesting is complex regional pain syndrome tends to affect the distal limb. It affects an arm or a foot more commonly, but that doesn't mean it doesn't affect the shoulder or the knee or the hip or the spine. But generally speaking, it is seen more in the in the distal limbs. Yeah, so the person, the, the hallmark is what the person will tell you, and that is this pain is terrible. It just doesn't go away. You know, normally if something's sore and I put my foot up or I put my hand up or I just rest, it will feel less. With mm -hmm. complex regional pain syndrome, even if you're resting or sleeping or, or just trying to relax, it still hurts really, really badly. And then when you try and do things, well, the, the, the soreness can become exponential. So that's what it is. Yeah.